hold triangle to enable menu narration. Enable Children of God, I'm's beginning. It was dark. There was no sand. There was no sea. No earth. Nor sky. No grass. Nor wind. Till fire met ice in the gasping void. From this green came the giant Ymir, first of all beings. Proud Ymir, cruelly killed. Yet from whose bones and blood and brains the world was made. The world you walk and war upon. Thank <laughs> you. 
there you are. friend. My sword is called greedy. I'm ready to fight. So nice having all of these hearty folk in our home. Sturdy long ships. Mm. Give it here. I'll pass it on. My father asked me, Sigurd. Suit yourself. But you're not getting any mead. Valka <laughs> Seder works through my hammer. <laughs> Speak with the king. Hold it up to the light. Show him the fine details. See there? I etched his name in runes on the outer band. You'll show him? Mm -hmm. You are just like your father, little berserker. Skull to you. Skull! You see? She agrees.
Forever bonded in friendship and love. <gasps> Thank you, Eivor. Now and forever, I am pledged to you. <laughs> Hearken well in Hall of Kings. <sighs> On ocean steed, my words gain wings. All then speed our forth will bring. A noble beast that on us sing. The brave men slain, Valkyria awakes. Rewards for strain to our huddle takes. And horns resound the mighty horn. Not just yet. It is foretold. The curtains are raised. Nothing is true until it is severed from the branches of Yggdrasil.
Fix this or pull me out. I can parse the streams with a filter. Hold on. Okay, we're good. Are we? I don't know what happened, but I can work around it. You'll have to pick a stream to keep things stable. There's a third option, too. I can let the Animus modulate your identity based on signal strength. It's up to you. in and push ahead to a time where these streams are more synchronized. Okay, so at this point my files got corrupted. This part of the game was not recorded. When I looked back on it, it was plain black. So pretty much what happens is the main character, I will butcher her name uh, but she pretty much uh, gets kidnapped by a big old bad guy that killed her parents and big old bad guy um, does just she just reminding her that she lives as a slave now under his command and um, so she yep yeah, so she's a, pretty much a slave now and it, it, she gets pushed onto a boat that I think they're gonna um, like ship her off to as a slave now so they push her on, she ends up killing and tackling the other two guys that were there. She takes the key off one of the guy's necks, uncuffs her little handcuffs, and then she continues to stroll away like nothing ever happened to go find her crew. And that is where the game, well, that is where the gameplay continues. Thanks, bye. And I'm um, sorry. <laughs> that for later.
Do you see?
Chatvis warriors. We should stay out of sight. Once this land is under Chatvis' lash, we will live like Jarls. It will not happen while Ravenclaw lives. They fight like berserkers. Eivor Wolfkist killed a score or more single-handed. Ha! Eivor now tastes the slaver's whip. And with Prince Sigurd likely lost at sea, the ravens will soon be a memory. Clash of iron. There is fighting nearby. Dag, you old hound. You live. I do. Slipped away in the sword clash. And what of you? Chotve tried to sell me off. A mistake he'll regret. Not today he won't. I saw him board a ship at Davald's Nest not long ago. Sailed east, leaving our crew behind. There must still be time to save our men. I will find them. You ready the longship. You glory hound. You would take the rescue for yourself, so the victory song is written about you. I could storm the beach then, slay two dozen men, seize our dragon boat, and hoist the sail in triumph. Up to you. No, no, I will take the beach. A far more dangerous path. You search the longhouse for our crew. Oh, and here. This corpse will not have need of it. Go. I'll meet you by the ship. 